Good morning, everyone. Happy Monday. We're actually kind of in a little rush because, oh, my windshields are on. Actually in a little rush because it is almost 6.45. And typically I wake up at six, but for, for some reason my alarm didn't go off. I've been using the hatch alarm since May, um, minus the like time I was <laughs> in Europe. I wasn't using it then, obviously. Um, but I've never had an issue with, with it actually. So I was like, oh, this sucks, I wonder why. But what I think happened is I have like a night routine on it. Like I press the night button and like for an hour it is a certain color. And then for the next hour it is like a sound machine, whatever. So, fuck, oh, I hate that it's that. Yeah, if my camera can see me, so sorry if I'm not in frame. This, I'll try to make this clip quick, but I think when I was going to press my night button, I I know for a fact I did tap the like the morning button, which is usually what you click on to like turn off the alarm in the morning. You have to hold it. I think that could be why, or I turned off my alarm and I just forgot to set it. I need I really need to check because that is quite possible since. Thursday and Friday of last week, I didn't babysit either. But then I'm like, my alarm did go off at 6 on Friday. I don't know. Anyway, I woke up like right before 6.30, like 6.27 or something like that. And I am supposed to pick up London at 7, which his place is like 15 minutes away from mine. And so I was just like, oh, wow. And so thankfully, I woke up with enough time to like right now I'm glad it I wasn't sleeping in until like eight or something hopefully one I would have like called me by seven if I hadn't woken up but anyway really quickly um, so I can freaking end this video clip it was seven Lana and I are gonna go on a run and then we're gonna go we'll get some coffee I think and then we're gonna hang out before I have work at 11 30 I had the option to go in early like I did last Friday to take the time to appreciate a moment with my partner because we have not hung out in a while it feels like I know we just went on a date last night but it just I don't know a lot has been going on like I went to Europe he was on um he was on rotation for pharmacy school and then like our timelines have just not been mashing up and so I'm I'm gonna take the time. I also just don't wanna work, and I think that's okay. Um, I should just to get the hours, but you know what? It's fine. It's whatever. I go back to babysitting tomorrow, and so that'll be good. That's the plan. I am, my goal this week is to vlog a little bit more than I vlogged last week, particularly when I go out. When I go out, I don't vlog. Like I'm vlogging right now, and I'm telling you like, oh, we're gonna go on a coffee date. But then I won't actually vlog the like coffee date. And so my goal is to do that this week, is just to actually show you guys things versus like doing them and then showing or telling you after it happens. Anyway, I'm rambling too much. I don't want this clip, or I don't want this vlog to be me talking a lot. So let's go, I guess. but I am off to work in like eight minutes ish so I just want to vlog but London and I made breakfast as you guys saw a little bit um, we ended up just driving through Duncan and having it with our breakfast and they've just kind of been hanging out on our phones kind of like alone time but together if that makes sense but yeah we both have work um he works 12 to 8 I only work 11 30 to 5 today but yeah that's the plan this is a fit and 
yeah, we're off. C group got canceled tonight. I don't know if I already said that, so I don't have that tonight. So probably just gonna have a chill night. Try to read. I really need to read. I haven't read like at all. So I think I'm gonna read and just, yeah, take a chill night. Um, yeah. vlog yesterday and so I am gonna tell you what I did yesterday in the hopes that today will be a better vlogging day. Today I babysat from 8 to 11.15 and then I worked 11.30 to 5 and then after 5 I went to London's house and we went on a run at Baker Wetlands. We started our run, run near 5.30 um, because obviously I had to get there and all that stuff. Um, and then after that, we ended up going to Popeye's, trying to eat in a calorie deficit in like a healthy way. And on TikTok, it's like a calorie def uh, calorie deficit um, meal from Popeye's, and it was actually really good. It was five strips of blackened chicken with the mashed potatoes and then a diet coke and the biscuit. So like it was a normal meal just so you guys know but um super good but we ended up waiting in that line for 30 minutes i'm not exaggerating like it was actually 30 minutes plus and i had a movie to go to we've been going to movies every tuesday we saw twisters last night i can't stop thinking about it i can't stop thinking about boom pow i need to stop also move some of anna's stuff into my apartment because my lease is longer than hers and we're moving into the new place on august 6th and so we moved a few things um here just to help lighten her load we're here it's wednesday i babysit again and then i work i think Lynn and i are either gonna go on a run or do another form of exercise today after i get off work we'll have the possibility of going to hot yoga tonight trying to decide i really don't know what i'm gonna do yet but we'll see I, um my little mini cinnamon toast things i'm gonna do some journaling make my bag get dressed and everything probably do that off camera but i'll be back after that i'm all ready i will accept my jewelry I actually think I might wear this hat because my hair is super greasy and I need to wash it tonight but I don't want to wear it in a like slip back because I took out my earrings for like to clean them but I had to keep in my thirds and my cartilage and I feel like the placement looks pretty weird so I'm trying to cover my ears but this is outfit fuzzies all over it but I think I'm just gonna do it and I'm breaking out over like in this area of my face start Accutane on Friday actually so super excited about that um I have a little bit I think I'm gonna read before I make my lunch and all that jazz but just wanted to update and say hey hey guys I am vlogging in the office this is my office I will say it's not like degraded at all for me personally because it was just like an old office that one was using. The only personality that is in there is my little um, personality is in this little board because I have my calendar, I have a cheat sheet. That's a fire escape route process of publishing. This is a schedule that I need to do. And then I have these two posters. This is the office if you wanted to see 
I do have a window out looking in the courtyard, but um, I hate having my back to the door, so I usually have the door closed, which I wish I could have open, but it, I hate like having people walk behind me. I don't know. Anyway, I just ate lunch. It is 12.02. I babysat this morning from 9 to 11.15. I think I already said that probably, but I don't have any meetings or anything like that today, which is kind of nice. Um, do some scheduling for we have to have a new internet guy come in for our new apartment that we move in on august 6th so i set that up um that week is gonna be crazy there's gonna be a lot going on but yeah that's the update just want to say hey update y'all but i'm gonna go now so bye hey guys it is thursday i think i feel like a little bit yesterday um but I, again, just worked. Again, I need to start vlogging better. I'm so sorry, that's gonna be my goal today. Even though I do feel like it's gonna be hard because after work today, I'm going to uh, dinner with London's family to celebrate his mom's birthday. And I'm like, I'm not necessarily gonna vlog there, but maybe I can take a few clips. I'm gonna, I'm gonna try to make it my goal to take at least a few clips. That way I'm not just telling you guys everything. Um, but I have been posting on TikTok a lot, like, short form stuff. Ooh. That's a really cute nightstand. I'm gonna go observe that really fast. it's in the back of my car hopefully it's good it looks really cute and I've been needing a nightstand I will say it's shorter it did not fit in the trunk of my car though so uh, playing tennis I ended up playing tennis with London for a little bit we only played for like 35 minutes I ended up not being in the best mood which is just frustrating I hate when I'm not like, I, I, I just hate when I get upset and anyway, but it happens. Um, but after that, we ended up stopping at Dylan's because I wanted to pick up a salad. Uh, so we got a Caesar salad and we also picked up watermelon. And so we had chicken Caesar salad because I had chicken and then we made that. We watched the second episode of My Lady Jane because I just love that show so much that I am forcing London to watch it um and then after that we packed or we kind of packed my kitchen as we were making dinner i think i have all my kitchen stuff in boxes i'm almost certain all my tupperware all my glasses all my plates all my silverware almost positive that all of it is packed of course i will have to like go through it all again but i'm like one room being done one room being done makes me feel pretty good or at least a little bit better. The car light is on, like my service engine light has been on for three days. And I do have to drive like a bit today. I don't lie, I am nervous. I'm gonna take the back roads and hopefully it'll be fine. I'll update you if it's not, I guess. But anyway, I'm kind of pumped for this dresser. I'm gonna see my dad tonight probably. So I'll have him look at it and see what he thinks, but looks pretty, looks pretty slay so far. Packing because I'm spending the night at my parents' house tonight, which is why I'm going to see my parents, obviously. And tomorrow I have my dermatologist appointment, which I start Accutane, which I'll vlog then. But I have been wanting to start Accutane, I think, for over a year, since last May. And it's just now happening. We're trying other things. Like I tried clindamycin, I tried spironolactone, I tried um, Tret. And I, I'm still using Tret. Well, I, I'll stop when I start Accutane tomorrow. But Tret is the thing I think that has helped my skin the most. And I use it like two to three times a week. I have to use it very minimally because my skin is so dry, which I am pretty nervous for Accutane. 
because my skin is already very dry and I'm just nervous. But I will say my face right now does not look that bad. Like, of course I always want it to be like more clear, but I'm happy with my face the way it is most times. So I mean, I do get frustrated when I get a new like hormonal pimple like I'm getting on my chin, that it's like, where it's like deep underneath the skin. But I would take this over what I was experiencing like January through March. That was just like insane. And I mean, I have all the scars and I probably always will, which kind of sucks. But, you know, I, for having just used like Tret and this be Tret's effects, I'm very happy with it and very grateful. And I'm just hoping that Accutane will make it even, even the more better. I don't think that was right English, but like it'll give me that extra, um, extra clearness that of course I desire a little bit. I just, um, I want to feel a little more confident and I already am again compared to like January through March was probably the worst period of my acne. I feel so much better compared to that when I felt then, but I'm just like, if I could feel just even like you know you always want to feel a little bit better 10% better every day but anyway I'm gonna go because I have five minutes to get there <laughs> and I'm probably like eight minutes away so it's not that bad but it's like oh um, I'm also gonna have to figure out how to put this dresser or nightstand in the trunk of my car since I have to babysit I have to drive them because the girl I babysit has danced today. Or I guess I could just leave it in their garage and then put it back. I might do that. But anyway, that's update. Sorry again for not updating y'all. I'm going to try to do better. Like I said, I'm going to try to vlog a little bit more today. Just a little bit more every single day is progress, I guess. But yeah, I'm going to go and I'll talk to you guys later. Brick. I've heard of it. On our way to someplace else. Like a soccer tournament? Mm, no. I don't think they would have soccer there. Maybe. I think maybe we're on our way to someplace else. Yeah. It was. Remember that caught in that parade and we just had to drive the van in the parade? <laughs> okay. I wanted to update. It is Thursday night. It is just past 10. And I'm currently in the Gregory. Um, guest room all ready for bed and I am going to play The Sims for a little bit probably just like 30 minutes or so because I'm pretty tired but I'm staying here because I have a dermatologist appointment in the morning um, so that's a vibe this is this is my room here I have a closet I have a shelf guitar file cabinet desk and then of course and then my nightstand it's not actually my room I'm just kidding I just sleep here but anyway that's an update excited for my dermatologist appointment because my acne is scaring me <laughs> dinner we went to ended up being a five course meal incredible i ended up having a beer with all five courses and so i will say i was tipsy i'm feeling much better right now but definitely was feeling it i was feeling a little embarrassed by how tipsy i was i couldn't say ovulation so that was kind of embarrassing, but we're here, we're ready for the night, and I'll talk to you guys later. Okay guys, I'm starting Accutane, I'm about to take the medication, the isotretinone is this orange, and then I'm taking two fish oil pills recommended by my dermatologist. Um, she also said to take Claritin, but I don't have that right now, so here we go. I have my Coke Zero to go with it. Okay. I took it. I I just took Accutane for the first time. Your acne's disappearing as oh I. Oh my speak. god, it's going away. Put the slim filter on right now. Um. Do the do the furry filter. You turn it to a furry. <laughs> That's what Accutane does. If you're if you're pregnant <laughs> on Accutane. Then. I don't think it's for you. Yeah, it's for the baby. Right. <laughs> Anyway, that's me. Day one of Accutane. I'm so excited. I... Yeah! Okay, bye. 
So as you saw, I started Accutane today. It's Friday. Had a pretty chill day. Um, spent the night at London's parents' house. I know I've already said this. We had a pretty slow morning and then I had my appointment. We dropped off the nightstand that I found on the side of the road. And then we had Chick-fil-A for lunch. And now I'm here, back in Lawrence. Um, and I'm currently getting ready for the Olivia Rodrigo concert in KC. Currently wearing black mini skirt. I've never worn it because it's just kind of out of my comfort zone. And then I'm wearing black Converse, but I feel like my socks kind of look weird with it. And then Anna has a shirt that is gray and it says, I see London, I see France. And I think I'm gonna wear that. So it's a pretty basic outfit, but I feel like it's fitting for her vibe. Um, but I'm currently packing because London has his family reunion. Um, he has his family re reunion tomorrow. So we're leaving at 7 a.m. We would go down tonight, but since I have this concert, we can't. So I just picked out my outfit. Here's my underwear, let's say Saturday. But I have this t-shirt and then just shorts. And then I think I'm gonna wear my Air Forces. And that'll be my outfit for there. And then I have my PJs and I have my outfit for tomorrow. And I think, I think honestly, I just need to like pack my toiletries, which will be a tomorrow morning thing. I'm pretty sure if I'm remembering everything. I think I'm gonna bring my laptop though because I obviously, I wanna start editing this video because I wanna post it on Monday because that's kind of like the routine, hopefully. But my plant is looking a little droopy. I think she needs some water. Give it to her. Give it to her on Sunday, but. Anyway, that's the update. I started Accutane, which is so exciting. I'll definitely have to make like a full video related to Accutane. So you'll probably see that clip that I included um, in like my overall Accutane journey. But yeah, super excited. Gonna vlog at the concert for sure. Uh, will probably be on my phone, but you guys are getting content anyway. But yeah, that's the update. Super excited. Need to get that shirt from Anna, but other than that, we're ready. What shall I do? This is what I'm wearing to London today at Lee's family reunion. And this blue tank top and some jean shorts and then I'm just gonna wear Air Forces. So pretty basic outfit but like casual and also cute. London is not supposed to be here till 7 but I just got ready extremely early. My dose just got done. I just heard it. Bree is sleeping on the couch so one second. my sheets off my bed and like I got all my baskets ready for laundry day tomorrow when I get back um but yeah these cinnamon toast things I don't know if I talked about these in this vlog yet but I'm obsessed with these always have been like there was one time my dad got these for breakfast and I think they were gone within a day or two days I will say there's four of us kids so we were eating a lot. So I put clips in from the concert, but it was so freaking good. And Panther is open, and I will say I only knew one song, but her voice stunning. I don't think I knew that she was English. I think she's English. She was beautiful, like stunning songs, stunning set. I loved all the songs, but I only knew one, which is That Boy's a Liar Part 2. The one featuring Ice Spice. Ice Spice did not come out. Anyway, um, yeah, Olivia came on. She came on at like 8.30 and I think the show ended around 10.30. She played a whole bunch of songs, all of them loved. I know that Lauren, one of my friends that I went with, 
to the concert. She said she would have preferred if Vampire had been later in the show, which I would agree with because it was like the third song. I think that's, I think I'm pushing it up. Let me see. It was the third song, so it was interesting. She did play a lot of sour songs. I'm like looking at the set list right now and I'm like, it seems pretty much. I'm gonna count how many guts and how many sour songs. Played 14 gut songs, which I actually, I'm gonna look at how many songs are in the guts album. She didn't play Scared of My Guitar stranger or girl i've always been i think those are the only three songs she didn't play uh from guts and those are from guts spilled the deluxe version 11 songs so she played almost all of them the ones she didn't play from sour was hope you're okay and then one step forward three steps back so it was a really great show i'm very grateful we went our seats were not the best but like i didn't care i thought it was still awesome and i'm so excited because i have like three concerts coming up in September, I have the Gracie Abrams and Role Model concert. I saw Gracie a Abrams as an opener for Taylor Swift last year, and then I saw Role Model in October of 2022 for his RX um, album, and I just love both of them so much, and so I was like, you know what, I'm gonna spend the money. We ended up buying tickets resold or from a reseller. So that's in September. And then in November, I have the Billie Eilish concert. And then in December, I have Suki Waterhouse concert. So I am like stacked on concerts. I'm still so sad I missed the Noah Khan concert because I was abroad. But I was like, I was abroad. So should I really be that sad? No. But am I? Yes. I'm so sad about it. I wish I had gone. But someone used my ticket and it was fine, I think. Um, so yeah, it's totally good. My nose is like so close. No. Anyway, this is such a long clip. I'm gonna go, so I'll talk to you guys. Hey guys, we're in the car. There's London. We just stopped at Scooters to get a little breakfast. I got an everything bagel sandwich. The guy was like, can I interest you in a everything bagel sandwich? And we were just like, yes, you can. And <laughs> we think we were probably the first people at least today that have said yes to that question. And it gives me some sort of joy in knowing that. And then I also got a small car malicious. This is a small. This is huge. sips of my caramelicious if he wants but anyway we have two hours exactly to drive so we'll get there just after nine hopefully or around nine, in the nine o'clock hour but i'm gonna eat this and i'll talk to you guys later Sunday. I just spent a little bit of time packing up my room. Still have a lot here, obviously, but some things are gone, which is good. But today we got back at like, I got back in my 12 o'clock hour, and then I ended up eating lunch. Just had a hot pocket with a Coke Zero. And then I ended up editing a little bit of this video, and then went to Target, picked up some stuff because I needed to start packing. Packed. The reason I did not vlog during all of that stuff is I have been on the phone for my, with my mom for a while. I've been on the phone with my mom for a while, but I'm like, I'm getting hungry, so I went to McDonald's. And I actually spent 30 cents on sweet and sour sauce, and they didn't even give it to me, so what's that about? But I will say I only spent like $5.30, which is fine. But I'm going to eat this. I want to say hey. I'm going to vlog for the rest of the evening before I finish up this vlog so it can go out tomorrow. Um, but yeah, this weekend was so much fun. I didn't vlog a lot. I need to stop saying it. Because we're going to start vlogging a lot more. Update on the Accutane. I will say it could be placebo, but I swear I feel my lips being dried out right now. Anyway, I'm going to eat this. And I'll talk to you guys later.
Okay, hey guys, I wanted to update. I last saw you guys when I was going through my bathroom stuff. I didn't really pack anything in there, but I organized things. I do need to pack it, but I don't know the best way to do that. Like if I should do a cardboard box or what, whatnot. But then I came back and I was reading a little bit. I'm doing a vlog of me reading this book because I have four, like the previous seven books in the series. But anyway, it's almost nine. I want a snack but then I'm also like do I need one or like you know do I just I don't know but anyway I kind of want a snack so I might do that I might just have like some ice cream and some cookie dough ice cream but I think I'm gonna brush my teeth and wash my face and then I'll say good night to you guys before I head to bed because again I need to edit these clips get them ready for you so good night peace and love Bye guys, for me sleep paralysis is the end.